Sitting around the house day by day. I ain't got much to do, but there's always lots to say. But well, the doctor dropped in, he said my blood was low. So I ain't worked since. That would been about five years ago. Well, it's a brand new house, got nice pictures on the wall. Of course, it belongs to my brother. His name is Paul. I'm wearing his suit. He bought it brand new. Hey, I drive a nice car. Right? That's his, too. <laughs> well, there's not really much mine except my overalls. And they was dirty when I found them hanging out there in the hall. But my brother Paul, he's making a pretty good pay. So I'm eating pretty regular. About ten times a day. Well, once in a while, I step out for a munch. Cause my credit's always good down at my brother's lunch. I think I'll get married towards the end of the fall. Cause my girlfriend is getting tired of running around with the wall. <laughs> well, seeing as my brother's so good to me, I don't think this here house would be too small for three. But if my house starts getting too small for the four, I think my brother's gonna have to sleep with the guy next door. <laughs> But he's understanding that way, my brother Paul. I only hope that my brother can support us all. But if he can't do it, we'd have to get a divorce. Unless my wife would rather start uh, working, of course. I had a dream last night about my brother and me. He grabbed a big gun, I climbed a big tree. Of course, it was only a dream. He wouldn't hurt his brother, Tim, because he's so good to me. I'm so good to him. They say a rolling stone never gathers any moss. So when I'm away, I always let him be the boss. Oh, gosh, I just remembered. I lost my glass eyeball. Hey, dog, don't swallow that. It belongs to my brother Paul. <laughs>